indoors today. Indoors. It was a little rainy out there, a little wet, so we're indoors. And a boy YouTube. And a boy. And a boy. All right. Yes, indeed. Is that lighting better? That's a little better. Yeah, a little bit. Facebook's live, YouTube's live. Check in, you know the drill, with your nickname, breakfast, go. All right, Georgie, Instagram. sunny now, but now we're up and running. YouTube in the house, George Washington, Cheerios, ready to go. Welcome. Coach Ballgame Facebook there. We're live on Instagram. Boom, check in. Hello, everybody. Welcome. Checking in. The Coach Ball Game. The Coach Ball Game PE class. We are up and running. I'm going to move this up just a touch. Check in with your nickname, what you had for breakfast. Hello, kids. Check in with what you had for breakfast. And then where you're from. I want to know where you're all from. I'm going to type that on the YouTube. Where is everyone from? Enter. It's Elia. Lou Ellen. Hello. All righty. Facebook's firing up. What is it? Five till? It was rainy this morning, so I set everything up indoors, but now it's sunny. So, part of me wants to move outside, but I've already set up quite, quite the deal here. Let's see, what was your breakfast? Oh yeah, Link's gonna go breakfast afterwards. Kingman, Knox, and uh, uh, Knox the Fox in Hollywood, they had a great video yesterday dancing. Good to see everybody, welcome to the live Coach Ball Game. PE class, uh, egg sandwiches for super coos, at a boy. Red or cheddar? 
and Andito Burrito Steak and Eggs from Mission Viejo. Hey everybody, check in with your nickname, what you had for breakfast, and where are you from? I want to know where you're from. We've got some newcomers today. I know we do. We've got some some homeschool groups that are in the house. Uh, on Instagram, I see Cool Socks from Orange. I had cereal for breakfast. Oh, Dan Nagy's in the house. Yes, Sarah Madden's in the house. Go check out her uh, awesome, awesome Instagram page. She's working out. Sarah Madden, B Street's working out with Coach Cornfit. Oh, good morning, everybody. Check in with your nickname, what you had for breakfast, and where are you? Where in the world are you? Mr. Angel and Green Monster had a breakfast sandwich. That's so yummy. That's so yummy. Yeah, yeah, Chris is in the house. What was the name of that dance we did at the Wiggy wedding? Springer's in the house. Are the kids watching? Are they ready to get up and up and dance? Spring room. Dan Spring runs Spring Training Baseball Academy. We went to college together, played music together. Been pals forever. Birthday girl on triple threat had puffs. I love it. Oh yeah. Trowling. Can't wait to see a, a video today of you, Chris, troweling uh, in your jean shorts. Welcome to a Thursday. Everybody in the house, you got YouTube, which is the widest view. Uh, and then you've got Facebook and Instagram. Check in with your nickname, what you had for breakfast, and where are you from? Where are you? Welcome. Ozio had eggs in Santa Ana. Love it. Race car master and all the toys had oatmeal in Irvine. Love that. Kelly Smith's watching from Asheboro, North Carolina. Good morning from the artist. Got a boy pop tarts and ice cream for the Hill family. I see some Arizona cottage cheese. Cottage cheese salute. But I'm healthy. Rock and socks, Coach Ballgame. I appreciate it there. Uh, Christine Lewis. How's everybody doing this morning? Thursday. We'll get started in like two minutes. Once again, check in with nickname, breakfast, and where you're from. Love it. Love it. Jake the Snake and Sam I Am in Asheboro, North Carolina. Potter Pickle had Cheerios in Irvine. I'll keep spreading the positive vibe there. Just in time baseball. Go check out Just in Time Baseball for some fun. Love it. Big Willie Free Ch <laughs> Big Willie Free Chili. The Doughboy. Good gracious, South Philly in the house. Shredded wheat for Brooklyn. I love it. I see California. I see Arizona. I see North Carolina. I see Boston. Grand Salami had Frosted Flakes. Way to go, Dana Point representing Paintbrush and Cheerios in Irvine. Honeycombs in, is that Maine? Mr. Chris, Maine, New Hampshire? Kickball. a boy, Black Eye. Black Eye might be the best nickname of the day so far. Crime Frog, okay, tie for first. Crime Frog and Cheerios. Hi, Coach. I know, not able to do any lessons this week, uh, but you know, just take it day by day, and hopefully you can tune into my PE class every day. We're gonna do some baseball lessons here, virtually, 
Jackie Robinson and Soccer Girl are in the house eating breakfast. I love it. So hey, if you're just checking in, um, do a little, do a little march, do a little march right here, and start smiling. Start smiling, and don't forget to check in. Nickname, breakfast, and where are you? Where in the world are you? Uh, Italy, North Carolina. Where are you? So this is our warm up. That's it. Here's our warm up. That's right. We're just marching. That's really it. Checking in, making sure everybody's ready to go. We're not running, we're just marching. And I'm indoors today. Indoors today, it was a little rainy this morning. Now the sun's out, so I could have been, but I like to go indoors with you guys. I love the videos and uh, pictures you've been sending in. It's been awesome. I've seen videos of like 11 year olds uh, taking batting practice in the living room, two year olds doing jumping jacks, uh, and everywhere in between. It's been amazing. I love it. I love it. I've already set up my bases here in my little room. Oh, Flying Chicken Tender now takes over the best nickname of the day Sleepover in Costa Mesa. Loving it. Oh yeah, Jackson Storm, blueberry pancakes, tasty. Welcome everybody. Check in. There, it's Maine. I know it was Maine. Traveling in Maine. All right, start marching. That's it. Uh, there's a slight echo. You know, let's try this. Ah, uh, does that help any at all? Does that sound a little better? I opened up the back window. I know there's an echo in here. Things you got to do when it rains. Did that help the echo at all? Hopefully. We're marching, and we're going to give you 30 more seconds. 30 more seconds to check in before we get going. Today is what a ball player does Thursday. That's right. Ball players are different. When everybody else is... Uh, not being nice, a ball player is being super, super kind. When everybody else is walking real slow, a ball player is running real fast. So let's go ahead and start with the hustle salute. Deep breathe in through the nose, out the mouth. All right, it helped. Thank you, Llewellyn. Llewellyn's so awesome. Oh, I hope John Boy's running in place right now. Go watch some John Boy. They are doing play-by-play -play of 1970s games because they love baseball. Outstanding. Hustle salute and three claps. One, two, three. Don't forget to check in. Arms up. Don't forget to check in with your nickname, what you have for breakfast, and where are you from. Show off those armpits. I put deodorant on today. First time in a while. Awesome. Touch your toes. Don't pick your nose. Outstanding. Spread out wide and snip your left kneecap. The scientific term is patella. Sniff your left patella. Type in what your left knee smells like, folks. What does your left knee smell like? Mine still smells like cat food, and I don't even have a cat. My wife's allergic to cats. Switch. Sniff your right knee. Oh, my right knee smells like um, icy hot. Icy hot. Now side to side. Side to side. Don't forget, take those photos and those videos and tag Coach Ball Game. That way I can see him and post them. Let's just go ahead and do your favorite dance move right here, right now. Ten more seconds of your favorite dance move. And three claps. One, two, three. On your behonkus butterfly. 
hands. Stretch out the butterfly. If you're just tuning in, check in with what you had for breakfast, your nickname, and where are you from. Check in with that. Make a V. Touch your left phalange. Yes. Green socks today. Right phalange. Touch that right phalange. Both phalanges and say something real kind to somebody in the room. Say something kind. Norman, I love you. Also got George here today. George, curious George. I love you too. Modeling pose, left leg out, right foot across. Twist and look behind you. Now hug that knee into the chest and real loud say, I love you knee. I wonder if Jim Nance is watching today, working out with his kids, or maybe the Dan Patrick Show. I bet they are. They're probably watching right now. Let's give Jim Nance an attaboy. One, two, three. Attaboy. Switch. Twist and look the other way. My back popped. If your back pops, say, oh, my lanta. Now hug that one into the chest and say, I love you too. Saw Jimmy Fallon doing some awesome stuff uh, from his home. Let's give Jimmy Fallon an Anna boy. One, two, three. And a boy. He's spreading joy. Downward facing dog, folks. Upward facing dog. Bark like a dog. Roof. Roof, 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 roof. Arf, arf. Half moon. Half moon. Other side. Half moon. And up to your feet. All right, it's hustle salute time. Hustle faster. A little faster. Freeze. Faster. Freeze. Fast as you can. Freeze. Look to your left. Smile. Look to your right and laugh. <laughs> three claps. One, two, three. Eye black salute. Mustache salute. Beard salute. Mullet salute. Brad Pitt hair salute. Double bicep. Triple bicep. Quadruple bicep. Scholar. Somebody's being smart, give them the scholar salute. Bounce back. If somebody's getting real tired, but they bounce back and they keep trying, bounce back salute. And my favorite, the sportsmanship salute. Somebody's being real kind, give them the sportsmanship salute. Also, introducing a new one. If anybody's being real quick today, give them the kitty cat salute. So everybody act like a cat for 12 seconds. Tucked in. 
There is no way you can answer your flip phone that's on your clip unless your shirt's tucked in. So tuck that shirt in all the way around. We're gonna run faster, throw it harder, look way better. 10 jumping jacks on your marks. Hope you're all tucked in, get set, go! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good, team meeting pose right here, team meeting. Take a deep breath. If you needed a little more time to tuck that shirt in, go ahead and do it. Who can tell me the most important part of the team meeting pose? Uncomfortable what? That's right. Shoulders back, sit up tall, poke your chest down, chin up, balance an imaginary cup of cranberry juice on your head with the uncomfortable eye contact. Very good. We're going to do some interaction. Uh, and I'm going to give some shout outs to whoever can answer these questions the first. All right. So first trivia question is, why does a ball player give a coach uncomfortable eye contact? Who can answer it the quickest? And then whose parent can type it the quickest? You will get a shout out. Uncomfortable eye contact. Why? I love it. Trace the Nutcracker played with the toy as a kitty cat. Respect. Boom. I believe that was it, and that was Boston, Boston. It shows respect. It also shows the coach that you're listening. So uh, let's give Mr. Boston, Boston uh, an attaboy on three. One, two, three, attaboy. If you're just tuning in, we're just getting started. Check in with your nickname, what you had for breakfast, and where are you living? Where are you at right now? Very good, very good. Uh, next trivia question, something a ball player does. We've talked about what a ball player does. Ball players are different. Maybe something you've already done this week. Something you've done this week, maybe for your parents. What is something a ball player does? Yes, yes, Triple Threat said pay attention, that's very good. So they know you're listening, Fitbit, that's right. Sleepover says the same thing, so you know what to do. Very good. The Nichols fam's in the house. That's right, Nichols fam. So you know you're listening. Show respect. I love it. I love it. Hey, we've got a unique opportunity. We're ball players, and everybody else watches us to see what we do. And if we're spreading joy, then they're going to want to spread joy. If we're spreading kindness, then they're going to want to be kind. Pretty cool, huh? Awesome. Okay, set up your four bases. If it's just trash, set up that. But you've got home plate. Maybe you have to use a sock or a piece of trash. You've got first base. You've got second base. And then you've got third base right here. All right? Shake out those hands. Shake out those arms. First one we're going to do is push-ups, jumping jacks, and dance move. All right? So you'll run the first base fast as you can. Four push-ups. One, two, three, four. Run the second base as fast as you can. Four jumping jacks. One, two, three, four. Run the third base as fast as you can and do your favorite dance move. And then back to home. Very good. You're going to do that circuit three times through, and I'll play some music to cheer you on. Please comment with what you are doing as a dance. I'm going to take a little milk break here. Comment with what you're doing as a dance move. By the way, these are called dugout mugs. Go check them out. He made me my own dugout mug here. Perfect for drinking milk. As you can see, we're, we're milking it today. Oh, that's good. It tastes even better out of these dugout mugs. Okay, so let me know what dance move you're doing, and then let me know when you're done. Let me know when you finish your, uh, your three sets. Once 
you're done, get a water break. Once you're done, get a water break. Comment with dance moves. The West of Fam is done. Anderson's Flossin. The show is done. Get some water. Once you finished up, get some water. Smile at some people. I see the Orange Justice, Fireball, and Money Finder are doing the floss. A lot of flosses. The floss is still very popular. And I can do it real good when my shirt's tucked in. When my shirt's untucked, I can't really do it as good. All right, if you're, if you're feeling good, if you don't need that water break, then just floss dance and see how fast you can do it. How fast? How fast? We're taking that water break. Triple threat did the shaky. Wow. Hyping. Wow, 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 wow. Love it. Gene Carlo Stanton's done. Love it. Default dance. Bevmo did the sprinkler. Yes, the sprinkler is still going. The thing about dancing is, it's awesome. That's the thing about dancing. All right, water break. Water break. Now, at any point, if you're like, man, I'm ready to go. I don't need a water break. I don't want to chill out here. Then just run in place, frantically and inadvertently. Just do it. And think about, um, think about Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Think about your favorite cereal while you're running in place. Banana Crusher, you get a shout out, brother. And a boy, Banana Crusher. By the way, you know what Banana Crusher does real well? Other than throw awesome parties for his birthday, baseball parties, he gives uncomfortable eye contact. Let's give Banana Crusher an attaboy for his birthday. One, two, three, attaboy. Ubiquitous Nightingale. Beesh, we already gave Jim Nance an attaboy. An attaboy. The Angry Elf, love it. All right, are we ready for round two? Here we go. First base, burpee. Second base, sit up. Third base, sing your favorite karaoke song. All right, and I'll show you. First base, four burpees. Jump up, go down. That's one, jump up, go down. That's two, you're gonna do four of those. Then second base, we've got the sit up. You've got the sit up, do four of these. One, get up there. Boom, hands to the tibias, hands to the shins. And then at third base, sing your favorite karaoke tune, and please type what you're singing. Don't stop believing. This is for you, Jeff Nichols. Hold on to that feeling. Oh, man, let's give Jeff Nichols an attaboy. That guy, he smells good, and he looks better. One, two, three, and a boy, Jeff Nichols. <coughs> All right. So you're doing that three times through. We're going to do three times through there. Four burpees, four sit-ups, and four karaoke tunes. If you're maybe one or two years old and you don't want to do a burpee, then just break out a instrument and start playing, baby. Let me know what you're singing and let me know when you're done. I see Eye of the Tiger. Love that. Wow. Lucas is linking my video to Flipgrid. Is that related to face chat and snap doodle? Amazing. Thank you, brother. Loop away. I am a, I am a simple North Carolina man, so if anybody's got uh, ways to get this class out to the masses, please do so. Let's give Lucas, also known as Fireball, a scholar salute. Turn the pages of an imaginary book. Lost in the Woods did Old Town Road that song is still rocking and rolling. Gray is singing some, <laughs> wham, oh, Atlanta. Wake me up before you go, go. Makes me think of a guy named Bob Beebe. I got hurt uh, at my junior year of college, so I, uh, I was the announcer, PA guy for the baseball games, and I got to pick the walkout songs. So for our captain, Bob Beebe, I picked that song. 
and he loved it, I think. Don't Stop Me Now by Sleepover, love that. Follow the Yellow Brick Road, yes, love it, dream on. And do a, do a different song each time you go around. And then let me know when you're done. Shut up and dance with me. Nice. Love it a lot. Coming in hot. Wow. Jason and Heather Wright, they're done. Get you a water break or some milk. I'm doing the milk. I'm doing the milk. <sighs> Master Builder. Never gonna boop, boop, boop. Do, 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 do. Love that. Atta boy, Master Builder. Is apple cider with you? Coach Apple Cider? All right, baseball card did Old Town Road. Very good, very good. Now, if you're feeling a little bit tired, I love it, living on a prayer. Um, can't touch this. Ooh, do, 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 atta boy, Pirate. Um, if you're feeling a little tired or your, your heart is beating a little much, put your arms above your head and breathe real deep. If you're like jumping off the walls and you need to do more, run in place frantically and inadvertently. Absolutely. Love it. Milk. Milk is so good. Take me out to the ball game. I love that. Love it. We will rock you. That's Canada, folks. We have uh, jumped over to Canada with old Marv. Marv, what's the boys' nicknames? What are your nicknames there, Canada boys? The Flying Squirrel saying, born in the USA. Love it. Eye of the Tiger. This is great. If you're just joining us, we just, uh, we just finished our second circuit, which was hustle to first base, four burpees, up and down. Second base, four sit-ups. Third base, Karaoke, your favorite song. And then water break. Let me know. Let me know when you're done. Wow. Let's kill this love by Bang Bang Bang. This is some heavy stuff. I am loving it. Wow. Very good. There's a lot of Bon Jovi and Journey in this next generation, and I love it. I love it a lot. So good, outstanding. Drink that water, drink that milk, and then it's on to number three. Raise your hand if you're ready for circuit number three. Ready? All right. First, let's give Norman an attaboy, one, two, three. Attaboy, he's a sloth. And let's give George an girl. she's a monkey. One, two, three, girl. And now, give somebody in the room an attaboy or an attagirl on three. One, two, three. Sorry, that wasn't loud enough. I could not hear you, so we'll try it again. Uh, give them good, uncomfortable eye contact and sit in that space for a second. And then give it all you got. One, two, three. Very nice. So, our last run around the bases, go to first base and do whatever you want. Go to second base and do whatever you want. And then go to third base and do whatever you want. Go! I got a new instrument today, by the way. I saw the good old boys uh, playing this instrument on a show called The Andy Griffith Show, which all of you should watch every night at 5.30 p.m. Uh, write what you're doing. What are you doing at first base? What are you doing at second base? Maybe you're acting like an animal. Maybe you're uh, doing your favorite dance move. Whatever. You get to do whatever you want. And we'll do this twice through. Twice through. I think this is a version of the didgeridoo. 
which was invented by Joe Madden, I think. Love it. Tell me what you're doing. What's going on in there? You guys doing some stuff? Jordy 40. Two-year-old brother doing burpees. So we had a dance, we had a burpee and a push-up. Leisure's doing dance moves on all three bases. Love that. A lot of push-ups. Tay-Tay's in the house. Just start running in place, Tay-Tay, and, and laughing. Uh, push-ups, jumping jacks, and the best 80s hair metal scream. Yes. Outstanding. Awesome. Hello, everybody. Welcome in. TV show did push-ups, jumping jacks, and the hustle salute. Awesome, awesome. We're going to do that two times through. Some of you might be done. Get some water. And like I said, if you're just, you're, you're still ready to rock and roll, then go up and down the stairs. Run up and down the stairs, not too fast, or just run in place. All right, this is Active Thursday. We're staying active if you want to. Or chill out and drink some water. But this final circuit is run the first base and do whatever you want to. Do, 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 do. Air drums. Run the second base and do whatever you want to. Act like a mongoose. That's the mongoose salute. And you go to third base and do whatever you want to. I'm going to thumb through my baseball cards. Wow. Wow. And then do this. Woo! Right? Because I get to do whatever I want to. Very good. We should be just about done with that. And then we're going to take a water break. Team meeting pose if you'd like to. Love it. Baseball card did a uh, another song. I love it. Some snapping. I like that. Triple threat doing the twist at first, cartwheel at second, and a handstand at third base. I can't do any of that stuff. That's amazing. Babe Ruth pose. Oh, ho, 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 ho. what base did you do the Babe Ruth pose? Josh Prophet. All of them? That's amazing. And I got to see a picture of that. Send that to me. Squats, push-ups, and jumping jacks. All right, we're done. Can we move on? Should we keep going? Legs up on the wall. Love that. Love it. Ah, Auntie Tracy's in the house. Auntie Tracy's in the house. We've got both aunties, Tay Tay and Tracy, and maybe other aunties too. I'm sure my mom and dad are doing uh, some sort of calisthenics. I know mom was running around the dinner table. Penguin is screaming hysterically. Well, sometimes you just got to do that. Little sis is playing the harmonica. Yes. Guess who played the harmonica? Roberto Clemente, that's right. Love it, get some water. Team meeting pose. If you're, uh, if you're already done and you're ready to do something else, do the whisper at a boy or at a girl challenge with somebody in the room. And it's where you say, at a boy or at a girl, as quiet as you can. And I'm gonna do this right now. it the most quiet. Somebody play piano? Hey, handshake right there, I'll do that. Good game. Good firm handshake, good eye contact. Outstanding. Penguins running around the house now. Love it. All right, wherever you're at, we're gonna uh, we're gonna grab a, a ball up sock or a tennis ball or a wiffle ball. So bring it back in, grab that.
got the ball up sock, or you could use a tennis ball or a wiffle ball. And we're going to review everything we've learned this week. First one, high five the sky. Toss it up in the air, meet, squeeze, and freeze. 30 seconds, high five the sky. All right, you don't want to catch a cup of soup, right? Meet, squeeze, and freeze. Are we ready? On your marks, get set, go! Meet it, and squeeze it, meet it, and squeeze it, meet it, and squeeze it, but don't forget to freeze it. Meet it, and squeeze it, meet it, and squeeze it, meet it, and squeeze it, but don't forget to freeze it. Stop! How many did you do? I'm guessing you did more than you did yesterday. That's the goal. More than you did yesterday. Now, if you've got a wall, you're going to do the wall drill. Toss it against the wall, meet, squeeze, and freeze. If you want to use a glove, if you've got a baseball glove, you can do that. If you don't have a wall, you can do the bounce drill with your catching hand. Bounce. 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 If you only have a sock, then you can just do high five the sky again with the sock. Go ahead and go. 30 seconds. Ten seconds remaining. This is called the wall drill. No cups of soup. We want to go meet, squeeze, and freeze. And stop. How many? I see 45. From Fireball. Baseball card did 116. George Washington, nice job. The West of Fam in the house with 35. Baseball card, 116. Wow. I need the coffee that you are drinking this morning. Pickle, Peacock Girl, and Butterfly Girl love the Meat Squeeze and Freeze song. Yeah. Let's sing that together, folks. A one, a two, a three. Meet it, squeeze it, meet it, squeeze it, meet it, squeeze it, but don't forget to freeze it. Meet it, squeeze it, meet it, squeeze it, meet it, squeeze it, but don't forget to freeze it. Very nice. Okay, I'm ready to move on. Uh, this is a drill we did, I think, two days ago, maybe day two. But if you have a ping pong paddle or a ping pong ball, or maybe a bat and a ball, hopefully a wiffle ball, wiffle bat, or what I'm using, a spoon and a sock, a wooden spoon and a sock. But this is a little hand-eye coordination where I'm going to bat it up in the air like this. Oh, I got eight. I got eight. Hand-eye coordination. In baseball, you need it to hit the ball. In golf, you need it to hit the ball. In soccer, you need it to kick the ball. Hand-eye coordination. Uh, so comment with what you're using for this next drill. Call it ping pong drill. On your marks, get set, go. Ah, I need to drink a little more milk. Oh, man. And stop. What are you using and how many did you get? What are you using and how many did you get? We were right here, hand-eye coordination. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Boom, just like that. If you need a water break, get a water break. If you have milk, drink some milk. <sighs> Hello, Braden. You like my dance moves and my singing? Appreciate that. Mr. Angel uh, used a pool water shooter 
thing and some socks. Wow, sleep over used ping pong ball. Leisure over in North Carolina, a paddle and a sock ball. We're gonna introduce you to a brand new one today. And it's this, uh, this guy right here, his name's Ozzy Smith. He signed this ball. He taught me this drill. Ozzy Smith grew up in a place called Watts, California. He didn't have a lot of money. So the first glove he ever used was a brown paper bag. And he had this tennis ball and he did this drill called the Ozzy Smith drill. He would lay on the ground and he would toss the ball up in the air and he'd catch it, meet, squeeze, and freeze. So you're gonna do this for 30 seconds. Ready, go. Every time you catch it, say, Ozzy Smith, Ozzy Smith, Ozzy Smith, Ozzy Smith. 10 seconds remaining. And stop. Now, trivia question, what was Ozzy Smith's nickname? Whoever can uh, say it the fastest gets an attaboy or an attagirl. The two tiny ball games are uh, yelling over there, Auntie Tracy. They're coming in for the dance party in a couple of minutes. Wooden spoon and a sock for 10, 16. His nickname was not Sugar, but he was sweet. Do I see the wizard? I see the Wizard of Oz. Very good. Um, I see M. Calkin 17 and John Bibbo with the Wizard of Oz. Let's give those two guys a, uh, an attaboy. One, two, three. Attaboy! Very nice. Now, I want to do the Ozzy Smith drill one more time because the reason he won 13 gold gloves is he had great hand-eye coordination. And he did that same drill with his eyes closed. So we're going to try it. And this might be a little scary, but let's give it a go. We're going to try that same drill with our eyes closed. See how many we can catch, lay it on the ground with our eyes closed. Oof. On your marks, get set, go. Oh. Nah. I missed it. Fifteen seconds remaining. Five, four, three, two, and stop. How many? How many? Did you get any? I got zero on the eyes closed. Wizard of Oz. This is the eyes closed Wizard of Oz drill. Tennis ball and fishnet. Love that. Fitbit got 14. Catching Kitty got 24. Love it, love it, love it. Yes, the Wizard of Oz. So that's the Ozzy Smith drill. By the way, he won the Roberto Clemente Award too. And I got to meet him and I shook his hand and we gave Roberto Clemente an attaboy. So we're going to give Roberto and Ozzy an attaboy on three. Ozzy lives in Missouri, so you're going to have to say it pretty loud. One, two, three. Attaboy! The girls are almost ready. I do want to do uh, a little bit with the soccer ball. So get your soccer ball out. If you don't have a soccer ball, you can do the tennis ball, but it's very simple today. We're just gonna go from right to left, bop to bop for 30 seconds. Pass it back and forth. You don't want to kick it real hard. You want to keep it controlled. And if you want to move down the hallway, or if you're outside and you want to go in your backyard, 30 seconds on your marks, get set, go. Right foot, left foot. Control the ball. Right foot, left foot. Control the ball. Right foot, left foot. Right foot, left foot. 15 seconds remaining. 15. Five, four, three, two, and one. Very good. Applause. Now, if somebody uh, in your household is maybe struggling and they need a little help, then you can pump them up because ball players are always helping out uh, their teammates. So uh, give them a little pat on the back and say, get them next time or you can do it.
And then if you do that, you get a sportsmanship salute. Show the armpits. Let's all say sportsmanship salute together on three. One, two, three. Sportsmanship salute. That sportsmanship salute brought to you by Mucinex. If you are clogged up, grab some Mucinex. All right, guys, get the basketball. Get the basketball. Thursday is always going to be a review of what we learned all week. We learned how to dribble the basketball by keeping our hand on top of the ball. So if you don't have a basketball, use a tennis ball, and we're just trying to bounce it. And let's go right hand for 30 seconds. Go! How many bounces? How many basketball bounces? Wow, the Houston family with 100. Master builder, way to go. If you do not have a ball, some kind of basketball, then go tennis ball, or you can just go air ball. Use the air ball with a couple of dance moves, right? Or you can run in place. Somebody used a kickball and got 35. Mr. Angel with 31, love that. Pickle got 24. Orlando with 33. Love it. Keats McGeats at a girl. 10 with a tennis ball. At a girl, Keats McGeats. That's my niece. 43 for sleepover with a tennis ball. We're going to do this left handed. If you don't have a ball of any kind, tennis ball, something to bounce, um, then I'll let you have free 30 second time. Maybe sing, maybe dance, whatever you got. Left hand, stay on top. You don't want to get underneath. Go! Five seconds remaining. Five, four, three, two, and stop. Very good. All right, we're almost done with class. I want to uh, inform you that there's a class you should go to right when this one's done. It's my pal Cameron, and he's at Warstick. If you go to Instagram, at W-A-R-S-T-I-C, Warstick. They're awesome. He's a very positive leader. Uh, he's a friend of mine. We've done some podcasts together. He's going to be doing a juggling class. He's going to teach you how to juggle. And that is, once again, at Warstick on Instagram, W-A-R-S-T-I-C. I hope you go over there. That'll give you a nice little 15, 20 minutes of learning how to juggle. And he's got a real great vibe about him, just a positive leader. Um, awesome. I love these numbers going in. Somebody got 789, and that is amazing. Now we're going to close up shop, as always, with a little freeze dance. But I want to remind you, please do something awesome today for your sibling, for your brother, for your sister, or for your parents. Because ball players are awesome. They're awesome to their sisters and their brothers. Um, it's easy to fight, right? It's easy to say mean things. But awesome people like Ozzy Smith, like Roberto Clemente, they were very kind. So maybe you can come in tomorrow, Friday morning. And you can tell me what you did. What'd you do kind for your sister or brother? And uh, you see baby and bitty ball game. <sighs> Hopefully they do the same. Hopefully they'll do some what a ball player does activities. All right? So get ready to close up shop with a little freeze dance. And we're going to go with Avery Jean's favorite song, Boomerang, by Jaja Seaway. Yeah. Or maybe it's Jojo Siwa. Uh, nobody's ever seen this video. It's only got 838 million views. So start dancing. And freeze. This is the freeze dance. If I say freeze and stop the music, you freeze and dance. 
a spin. Do a spin. Oh, baby. Long day doing a spin. That a girl. What you got? Did you ball game? Freeze. Freeze dance. And go. Yep. Spread the word. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, Coach Ball Game. And I'll see you tomorrow morning at nine. Hey, what do you tell them? What do you tell them about the YouTube thing? There you go. Very good. And go to War Stick for some juggling. See you manana. Stop. I don't